Huh? Snail? Franklin, quick! Come quick! What is it, Snail? Uh, I saw something big. Big! Over there. It was strange, and it had a big pointy head. Huh? huh? I don't see anything now. <gasps> Footprints! Mighty molars! Look at that! Quick, Beaver! We've got a mystery to solve. This is a case for the Super Cloopers! Wherever there's trouble or a mystery to solve, there are the Super Cloopers! We are Book Whiz, smartest of the smart. Everybody knows that. Mega Bear! With his cupcakes of power, he's stronger than anybody! I am Mega Bear! Greatest gadget guy in the world! Awesome! <laughs> Galaxy Gal! <laughs> Oops! Magic girl with a magic wand! <laughs> the Giggler! <laughs> Funniest guy <laughs> Thunder Boy! With a voice like thunder! I am Thunder Boy! <laughs> and I am... Super Cloopers, we've got a mystery to solve. Thunder Boy saw something big and it left footprints. Look, they're all over. This way. What was it? Wait, my thinking cap is giving me an idea. I know who made these footprints. <gasps> the Berry Bogey. The Bogey? The Berry Bogey? Who's that? I read about it in a book at the library. The berry bogey is a big, weird-looking creature who lives in the woods and is really shy. Hardly anybody has seen one. Galaxy Gal and I will look over by the meadow. Giggler, you and Kid Gizmo check that way. And Mega Bear... Hold on, Bookwiz. Why do you get to say what we do? You're not in charge of the Super Cloopers. Well, I figured out it was a berry bogey, and since I'm the smartest, I should be in charge. Wait a minute. Why don't we just work together to solve I this? I know. The first one to solve this mystery will be in charge. Okay. Let's do it. Come on. Let's go. <sighs> huh? Sunflower seeds. Somebody must have been eating them. Maybe it was the berry bogey. <gasps> Book whiz, I found a clue. Don't tell me what it is. We have to solve this on our own, remember? Huh? Leaves with black and yellow paint. A clue. <clears throat> Whoa! Oof. Huh? A clue. I found a clue. Wait till I tell. <gasps> right. Gotta do it by myself. Oh, but I gotta tell somebody. What you got there, Giggler? A clue! A clue! I mean, nothing. I found a clue, too. You did? Let me see. Only if we do it together, okay? One, two, three, go! Coolio. Sunflower seed. Whoa! Is that some netting? From a hat, maybe. Or a kite. <gasps> Or a space suit. So the berry bogey eats sunflower seeds and berries. And come from outer space. Awesome. Okay, Cupcake, you can't be for my snack because you're helping me find the berry bogey. Just sit there and look yummy till he comes. <laughs> okay, I'll just wait here until he comes and then I'll say hello. <laughs> What's that? <gasps> the berry bogey. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> Kid Gizmo? Giggler? Two clues. We both found one. We gotta find some more clues. Come on! Wait! Hmm. Together, they have two clues. Hmm. <sighs> <laughs> 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 
No clue here. Mm. Nope. Hey! Mm. 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 <sighs> yeah, this must be from the berry bogey. Thank you, berry bogey. It was yummy. You can share more if you want to. Huh? It's gone! He ate it! He ate it! The berry bogey ate the cupcake! Mm -hmm. But I miss seeing him. Feathers. <laughs> Hi, Thunder Boy. Found any clues? Nope. Nothing yet. I know you'll find something. Good luck. Thanks, Green Wonder. Green Wonder, Green Wonder! I know I shouldn't be sharing clues, but I have a really yummy one. I left a cupcake for the berry bogey, and he ate it! <laughs> Can you believe it? Guess what? The berry bogey left me a cupcake, and I ate it all up. Super yummy. I wonder if there's any more. A, a cupcake? But Goose left a cupcake. Me Mega Bear! That wasn't the berry bogey! What? Oh! Mega Bear? <sighs> Mega Bear? Mega Bear? Mega Bear! Hiya, Franklin. Glenn, how's it going? What's the big rush, kiddo? I'm trying to solve a mystery. Did you see Mega Bear go by? Uh, Mega Bear, Mega Bear. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he went that away. Thanks. See you later. Mega Bear! Mega Bear! <sighs> Berry Bogey! Berry Bogey! <gasps> Book quiz! It ate my cupcake! Shush! No clue sharing! The berry bogey ate the cupcake! How about this? Clue? <laughs> nope, that's a rock. <laughs> <sighs> I gotta do something. We'll never solve the mystery with everybody running around on their own. <laughs> Nobody's having fun. Except Fox and Rabbit. I know how we can get everyone together and solve this mystery fast. Hey, Fox, Rabbit, wait! I got an idea! I don't get it. How does this solve the mystery? It doesn't. It gets everyone together. Oh! I knew that. How? Just walk and you'll see, Giggler. <laughs> Perfect. Some footprints. No, I found them. It was me. I found them first. It worked. Did it ever. Super Cloopers! I made these footprints. You made them? Not the berry bogey. Why? It was the only way to get everybody together again. Solving the mystery on our own isn't working. We have to bring all our clues together or we'll get nowhere. Green Wonder is right. We'll never find the berry bogey like this. Then we're a team again. Yay! Let's Super Clooper do it! Yes! Book Wiz, you can write down everybody's clues so we can see what we've got. Okay. I left a cupcake for the berry bogey and he ate it. Uh, it wasn't the berry bogey. It was me. I ate it. Oh. Okay, so the cupcake isn't a clue. I found this. I bet it's from a spacesuit. Ooh! I found sunflower seeds. That's a good clue. I found leaves with black and yellow paint on them. I found footprints. And I heard a weird humming noise. So put them together and we get a humming spaceman who likes sunflower seeds and wears a yellow and black shirt made out of leaves. <gasps> Hmm. Aunt Turtle? Huh? Hey there, everyone. Hey, hang on a sec. I'm just trying to paint some beautiful bees. <laughs> there we go. Benito. <sighs> How's the uh, mystery solving going, huh? We just solved it. Together. Our clues were sunflower seeds, yellow and black paint, netting and humming, and footprints. We found the berry bogey. It's you. <laughs> Me. 
Well, I'm a pretty nice fairy bogey, don't you think? You were right, Franklin. We had to work like a team. Yeah, you're a great leader, Green Wonder. You mean we're all great together, right? Yay, Super Coopers! <laughs> Elevator going up. Hi, Beaver. Careful, Snail. No sudden moves. I'm going for a new record. No problem. I'll use my tippy toes. <laughs> Ready? Shh. Hmm. Yes, yes. Yes! Huda Rabbit! <laughs> Not so fast. I want a rematch. Uh. <gasps> Goose! Oops. Shh. Quiet, everybody. Look at this. We've got company. Just like us. That's nifty. Great. Neat. Cool. Hey, neighbors. Ooh. Hey, our new neighbors are really tweet. You know, tweet, bird, tweet. <laughs> Rabbit. <laughs> you know, this is the coolest tree fort in the whole wide world. Uh-huh. I'll say. Yeah. yeah. Huh? Hey, guys. There's some funny-looking clouds over there. Funny? They don't look happy at all. Thunderheads! Hey, Mr. Groundhog, what did you say? Thunderheads? That's what you call those puffy dark clouds. A big storm is coming our way, and fast. You kids better get down from that tree fort and get home. OK, thanks, Mr. Groundhog. You heard him, guys. Let's go. <gasps> hey! Come back here. Go, go silly hat. See you later, alligators. Gotta go. See ya. Bye, guys. Franklin. Snail, you should come with me. We'll call your parents from my house. Okay. Thanks, Franklin. Hold tight, okay? Yep. Inside, everybody. Whoa. Come on, let's go. Okay, bye, Mom. Wow, Mr. Groundhog was right. That's the biggest storm I've ever seen. Storms are scary. It's okay, Harriet. There's nothing to be scared of. It'll blow over soon. How about a cuddle and a bedtime story? Yay! <laughs> what are you looking for, Dad? A flashlight, just in case the power goes out. Now I'm scared. You hold this, Franklin, and I'll go find the candles. I wish I was home with my mom and dad. Whenever I'm scared, I close my eyes and think of something that makes me happy. Okay. I'm thinking of my harmonica music. Now I wish I had that, too. <laughs> we'll go to the fort and get your harmonica right after the storm blows over. Okay, Snail? Okay. Thanks, Franklin. Did someone say music? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness we were together safe and sound during that big storm. Yeah. Thanks for letting me stay. Wow. 
Look at all the leaves and branches that came down. That's not all that came down. Need a hand with that, old friend? Thanks. So what brings you all here? <laughs> neighbors helping neighbors. Looks like you might need some help. Have you seen a lot of damage? Roads washed out. Trees down. Trees down? Where, Mr. Bear? Everywhere. Some of the oldest trees in the village are firewood now. <gasps> the, the tree, tree fort. fort! Can we go check on the tree fort? That way's been all cleared. You can look, but don't go inside until we come and check if it's safe, okay? Okay. Be careful, boys. Thanks, Mom and Dad. It's gone! And so is the tree. Hmm. Oh no! The toys! My binoculars! Smashed! My harmonica's gone too. Everything! Ruined! Well, not everything, Franklin. Remember this? Remember we had your birthday party in the tree fort? <sighs> we had so much fun here. Whoa. Oh, no, no, no! Where'd the fort go? Just look around. It's all over the place. Oh, no. The swing. <gasps> Our fort! It's all over the ground. We know. At least we can still play X's and O's. <sighs> oh, no. I wonder what happened to the birds. Maybe they went to find a new place to build their nest. Hey, that's what we should do. Build a nest? No, silly. Find a new place to play. A, a new place to play? Good idea, Snail. Yeah, okay. I'm in. I know a place. Come on. Check it out. Let's go. Come on. Uh, Isn't this great? Mm, not so much. Uh, I'm squished. Not really. I think we need a place where everybody fits. Hey, follow me. Uh, Come on. Right. Roomy, huh? And if you need more room, you just dig a little deeper. There's no light for reading or playing. You gotta have light. Everybody knows that. Now this is more like it. Yeah, it's perfect. Isn't it, guys? Except if you have fur. Or big paws that sink in the mud. Hey guys, look what I found. What? Remember how we used to haul things up to the tree fort with it? Like all my books. And I remember bringing up my mom's fresh-baked muffins for you guys. Mm. Yeah, and that's how I got up to the tree fort to see all my friends. The tree fort was perfect for everybody. And now it's gone. Look what I found! Hey, that's our basket! Look who's back! Welcome back. <laughs> Hi, birdies. Hmm. Hey, maybe we shouldn't be looking for a new play place. We should be looking for a new tree for a new fort. Follow me, guys. Come on, let's go. Wait up. Go. go. <laughs> we could build our new fort here. Yeah! Cool! Neat! Awesome! awesome. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I catch them, whoever it is. Uh, yeah. well, well, what's all the gefuffle about? Oh, hi, Mr. Groundhog. Um, we kind of lost our tree fort in the storm. And our tree. So we were wondering if maybe we could build a new tree fort in your tree. <sighs> Uh, well, uh, I'm not that fond of neighbors. It's too noisy. Oh, we're quiet as bugs. I don't care much for bugs either. Franklin. Hey, Franklin. 
We checked on the tree fort. I guess you kids must be pretty upset. We were at first, but I think we might have found a new tree to make our fort in. Maybe? Hmm. Well, <coughs> Mr. Mole, I don't have any branches to clean up, but you fellas could help me with something. Mm hmm I need a tree fort built in this tree. <laughs> I'm getting new neighbors. I could get you some hammers and nails from my store. I can swing a hammer. Climbing trees is kind of a specialty of mine. I'll do the high spots. And you can have free pickings from my junkyard anytime, kids. And I'm sure I could cut up some wood. Well, what do you think, gang? Cool. Great. Look, the birds are making their new nest in our tree. <laughs> We'd better make up our minds quick, or the tree will be all taken. All in favor of building our new tree fort here? Yes! That settles it then. Welcome to the site of our new tree fort, number two. Yay! Yay! Yay!